Here at home, the performance of the housing industry is key to an economic recovery, but the housing market is sliding backward. A report out today says home prices are down more than 5% in the past year, bringing them to levels not seen since 2002. Mark Strassman has more. The house is going for like half price. On Jewel Terrace, the American dream is underwater. That one was a foreclosure and the one next to it was a foreclosure. Calvin Carr counted nine houses in his cul-de-sac, seven of them foreclosures. This is a little discouraging, a lot discouraging, really. Everyone feels down in the Enchanted Forest subdivision. South of Atlanta's airport, home values have plummeted. 18 homes sold in the last year. 17 were foreclosures or short sales. Back in 2002, the family that lives here paid $126,000 for that house, which has a carbon copy right across the street. Same builder, number of rooms, square footage. This one is now for sale as a foreclosure at $38,000, roughly a 70% drop. But we tried everything we could to stay in it. First, Anthony Lane lost his job, then his house on Jewel Terrace, the same house Calvin Carr bought in a foreclosure sale. So we had a close little cul-de-sac right there and um it's all gone one by one yeah each one of them started leaving and and eventually it hit us and, and we had to leave too lane has a new job cutting the grass of foreclosed properties including the house right next door to the one he lost when you look at your house now what goes through your mind that's a beautiful house um you should see the inside at lane's old house calvin carr's right to worry the house next door is listing for $40,000, one third what he paid just eight months ago. Mark Strassman, CBS News, Conley, Georgia.